Hi guys, welcome to this video looking at the impact soot can have when it's produced during incomplete combustion. Now we've already talked about the fact that incomplete combustion can produce carbon monoxide, which is a toxic gas, but it can also produce soot, carbon. So there's a recap video if you can't remember about carbon monoxide, which I'll put a link to in the top right hand corner here. Today we're going to focus on what that carbon does. And the key thing is, it can block pipes. This can increase the amount of incomplete combustion, carbon monoxide and soot being produced. It can also blacken buildings so they don't look as good, and perhaps the most importantly, it can cause breathing problems. Now this video really is short but sweet, so type of question you could be asked in the exam is when a boiler becomes blocked, carbon, soot is formed, explain the disadvantages of producing soot in a combustion reaction. So it's worth two marks, two things. Pause the video, have a go, we'll see how you've done in a minute. Okay, two marks then, nice and simply. So it can block pipes, it can blacken buildings, and it can cause breathing problems. So any two of those three will get you your two marks. So I have got a review question for you. This is bringing everything together on incomplete combustion. So when a boiler becomes blocked, carbon, soot, and carbon monoxide can be formed. Explain the negative effect of these two gases. So the two marks we just talked about for the carbon, the soot, you should have that nice and fresh in your mind. Go back to the carbon monoxide video. The link is in the top right hand corner if you can't remember that one. That brings this video to an end. Hi guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please click on like down below. You can also subscribe to get more updates. You can visit the website for more information and you can look at my latest video. Thanks for watching.